Hi everyone and welcome to codingzest.com. Guys, in this Flutter tutorial, we will be looking at uh, refactor and extracting the Flutter widgets. Okay, so what I mean uh, by extracting or refactoring the Flutter widgets, so I will show you in this video. As you can see here uh, in our main screen, we have a center widget and inside our center widget, we have a column and inside a column, uh, we have three children, uh, one row uh, column. Uh, sorry two row and one column okay and inside the row as you can see here we have an elevated button a text widget and we have an icon button and inside the column we have these uh, same uh, widgets and this is our third uh, second row uh, below our column okay so if i expand all the code here and uh, as uh, you notice that uh, the code is a little messy and it is hard to find uh, a specific widget you uh, want to make some changes like if you want to change this icon uh, the the first icon button color so you have to go to the row and inside the row we have uh, here an icon button so if i want to change the color so i will simply go to the icon button and color and colors dot let's suppose i uh, make it red so as you can see here we change the this icon color but if you want to change this icon color or this text color so you need to scroll down here and this is in our uh, second row so this is our text view and you can make changes to this text view but but uh, i uh, write this code as an example and uh, if you have uh, multiple lines of code like uh, uh, 500 lines or 400 or uh, even uh, 1000 lines of code so you need to search for all widgets and uh, all these things okay so uh, to make it easy we have an option in uh, flutter application development to extract our widget as a method or as a widget so we will just only use that method or widget name inside our main widget okay so i will show you uh let me extract this column in the middle so i will go to the column let me close this rows okay so here we have our column this is our column and this is the ending of our column as you can see here so we need to select this column from here and we will okay uh, you just simply click on this to select all and also uh, press uh, shift key and click here so it will select all the column okay don't select this comma value okay so now what we will do what we, uh, we will do uh, we will right click on this okay and we will go to the refactor as you can see here uh, we will go to the refactor here uh, we have two options extract method extract flutter widget first of all i will show you how we can extract uh, it as a method so you can also use the uh, keyboard keys control alt plus m or if you are using mac so you can uh, use a command plus alt plus m okay and if you want to extract uh, this uh, widget as a widget so you you need to use uh, control plus alt plus w okay uh, m for method w for widget okay so uh, we will click on this extract method and now it will ask to uh, uh, give a name to this method so it's uh, up to you uh, which name you want to give uh, to your method so i will just simply call it uh, my column okay and i will click on refactor okay and now as you can see here now we have our column and if i save this so nothing change okay as you can see here nothing's changed and our method is below here this is our method so you can change this column to widget also because the column it is returning a widget so um, i will okay so as you can see here this is our method so we can use this method uh, inside our main uh, widget so if i use it uh, like here this so i will just simply type my column and if you need to make some changes inside this column uh, children so you need you need to open this method and you can make changes here like uh, i will uh, also change the color of this icon so i will simply type a colors dot blue and if i save it so as you can see here uh, now we have uh, two columns and uh, i change the uh, color 
uh, one uh, one time in our method so uh, uh, both of icons color are changed because we are using we are calling this method uh, two times okay as you can see here okay so now i will uh, simply uh, minimize this and now i will uh, show you how you can extract a widget as a widget so uh, we will select this row from here click here and uh, press shift okay uh, hold the shift key and click here so it will select all this row widget and i will simply right click here refactor and i will uh, extract flutter widget okay so i will click on it and uh, it will ask you for widget name so i will just simply name it uh, like uh, row widget okay so i will uh, click on refactor and now as you can see here we have our row widget and as you can see here now this is not a method this is a widget class okay so this is our widget and if i change the color to something like uh, um, tail okay so if i save it so as you can see here the color is changed and if i want to use this row again so i will uh, simply remove this column and i will simply call the row and as you can see here row widget row widget round bracket and i will add a comma here and if i save this so as you can see here now we have two rows uh, same rows eh? okay so that's how you can extract uh, and refactor your widgets in flutter so it will help you in the clean code because you will have a clean code so uh, you can also uh, uh, make these methods or widgets in a separate class like here if you want to create a sep uh, separate dart file for this uh, classes or uh, this widgets sorry uh, not classes uh, for this uh, methods and uh, widgets okay so you can also put it in another file so that's it for this video guys and uh, if you like this video please share this video with your friends and also make sure you are subscribed to my channel so you won't miss the upcoming videos